As we get closer to winter, health officials are stressing the importance of making sure your homes are tested for radon. And in Kent County, you can do it right now for free. 13 on your side's Josh Albertus joins us to tell us what the risk is and why officials believe testing is even more important in these colder months ahead. Josh. Yeah, Juliet, you can't see it, you can't smell it in, you can't taste it, but a radioactive gas that can be found in soil is a concern in the event that it builds up inside a home. The Kent County Health Department says, in fact, radon is the leading cause of lung cancer in the U.S. among non-smokers. Now, as we get ready to get our homes ready for winter, officials say testing is even more important, perhaps, and it's why some are offering the chance to do it for free. We like to test in the winter because your house is closed up. You're not, um, you don't have your windows open, you don't have your door open, and you're not airing out the house. So it's more likely to build up to higher levels in the winter. And in some areas, state data suggests the rate of tested households with elevated radon levels is higher than in others. When you're looking at the data, you'll see um, that even where there is testing, some areas tend to test high up high at or above the action level of four picocuries per liter more often than other areas of the state. At Kent County's Health Department, officials consider this to be a moderate area for radon. And now the department is offering the chance to test for this potentially dangerous gas for free. We have free radon kits for November for Lung Cancer Awareness Month. We will also have free radon kits in January during Radon Action Month. But how do these tests work? Basically, you're just going to open up an envelope, set it out for three to seven days, seal it back up and mail it in. We really want you to test the lowest habitable level of your house. So if you have a basement and you use that basement, test your basement. If your house is on a slab, test your first floor. And if you do find elevated levels in your home, the County Health Department recommends working with a registered radon mitigation company who can handle the job. They're gonna come in and see what they can do to get that radon out of your house or keep it from getting into your house in the first place. That might be as simple as filling cracks, um, covering holes from like pipes in your floor, or it may be a little more expensive or more expansive where you would need to seal it and vent it out with a fan. And according to one of those officials we spoke with, testing shouldn't be a one and done thing because of how the earth moves and how foundations and slabs under homes can shift, possibly allowing new exposure. He recommended regular testing either every year or every few years as things change. You can find where Kent County will be offering these free tests up on our website, 13onyourside.com. In the newsroom, Josh Obert is 13 on your side.